back to my channel. My name is Jamie, um, known as the Spooky Nurse. Definitely more spooky looking today than what I have been in my previous videos. Um, I'm finally back. It has been about a month, maybe a month and a half since I last posted my last video. Um, <laughs> it's my puppy Einstein. He loves to say hi, so... This is Einstein. <laughs> Sorry to interrupt the video. Um, but yeah, I'm back. Um, I actually, uh, my husband got very sick with some type of respiratory infection. He tested negative for COVID and all that, but um, we are back. Um, so of course, since he got the respiratory infection, you can guess who else got the, res got the respiratory infection. Um, I was like asymptomatic the first week, nothing crazy like that happened, but then um, got us, we actually um, were going to the Bad Omens and Spirit Box and two other bands were um, actually at the concert that we went to. Um, um, we actually, I, he felt better at that point almost just kind of short of breath sometimes, but I started getting a sore throat at the concert. The next day I woke up from the concert, <laughs> not good. Um, so I caught the respiratory infection. I was out of work for a week and then um, just couldn't film anything. And then like our house was dirty from us being sick and not wanting to clean. So I was kind of in a funk with filming as far as that goes, but here we are, we're back, we're spooky. We're being a nurse all of the great things <laughs> um that's kind of like the only update that's really happened since i've last been on here i'm in the spooky bedroom <laughs> um so yeah today's big video is a on a very small unboxing <laughs> um I decided to splurge a little bit and I bought some things from Killstar, which is one of my favorite companies. Not sponsored at all. I literally just love their products that I am willing to spend my own money to support them as a business. <laughs> um, and for anybody that's asked or wondering, because sometimes people wonder what people are wearing in videos and stuff, my hat that I have on is actually from Killstar. Um, if you can see, it's got little bats on it. I love it. Um, and then my dress that I'm wearing, it goes all the way up to my neck. Um, it's hiding my little choker that I normally wear. Um, my dress that I have, it goes to like the knee. Um, and then it's got the poofy sleeves on it and it's tighter up here. Um, this dress is from um, Boohoo actually so yeah i like boohoo as well but today is all about killstar we're going in with killstar and doing our thing with killstar um so yeah i have the magical box here with us can't do an unboxing without the box <laughs> um so yeah I actually had two boxes that I wanted to unbox from Killstar, but of course my husband got really excited, had to open one of the boxes and didn't want to wait for me to make my video. The other box had two um, doormats. So once I'm done with doing this unboxing, I will take you guys over to the front and the back door of the apartment and show you our new mats that we got. Um, they both already have a lot of cat hair on them because my cat is a 20 pound monster that does nothing but shed. But that's besides the point. <laughs> um, they're still really cute. I love them. Great quality. Couldn't have asked for anything better from Killstar. <laughs> um, and then, of course, to help open the box, he has a lovely knife. Um, I'm going to put Einstein on the floor because don't trust him. All right, where were we? So, yeah, it's not really anything special as far as packaging. Um, just a plain brown box um so you guys like if anybody wants to comment down below but i absolutely love unboxing videos and seeing what people get because it inspires me and persuades me to buy stuff 
obviously, here we are. Um, especially, too, there's another YouTuber that I love to watch. Um, and she likes to shop at Killstar, too. I'm obsessed. She does spooky material, too. She's not a nurse, but she does spooky material. Her name is Jade the Libra. I highly recommend. She does everything spooky all year round. Um, <laughs> he's got a stuffed animal heart that I gave him. He's just walking around with it. Um, but yeah, she is absolutely incredible. She does spooky stuff all year round. Um, she's one of those people too. She does a lot of like lifestyle vlogs type of thing. She does a lot of reviews and hauls and she's just great. A very wholesome person too. Jade the Libra, if you're listening, I love you. That was a satisfying cut. <laughs> um, here we go. So obviously I know what I ordered, but this is my first reaction to everything out of the box as well. So, here we go. Okay, so the first thing in the box that is on top is the draconian waist cincher so this is um something that i've kind of been wanting i've seen a lot of people have them and i really like how they look and you put it on um like over a dress or a big t-shirt and it really makes you look like you have a tiny waist and i feel like it gives like outfits that dramatic look which i love um so i was thinking the way i'm gonna do this is i'm gonna unbox everything show you guys and then um, in between me talking about the product, I'm going to show like it on with me in the mirror with an outfit and see what you guys think of it. But, oh, yes, girl, this is cute. Okay. So I see how this goes. Um, we actually have a bunch of buttons here. Um, buttons and then that's where it clips on the other side um this is the part that you wrap around yourself but look at how pretty this design is so pretty and then it's got a zipper in the front that you can zip up and down so it can actually become I think completely detachable which that's really cool yeah if I undid the zipper all the way completely detachable so love that um two what's really nice about this cincher is it's super if you can i don't know it's not the best lighting but super stretchy material here on both sides so when you go to put it around your waist it's gonna be able to fit without being like hella tight um so yeah very pretty. Like I said, um, I'll insert clips as I go of me with it on, showing you how it looks on me and everything like that. So this is very cute. Absolutely love it. Um, next thing. So the next thing is two pieces. Um, I really wanted them. Reminded me very much of Beetlejuice vibes. And I like the top because the top you could really wear with other stuff like jean shorts would look really cute or black jeans something like that or ooh, a black skirt but um i got the matching skirt with it because i was like oh i kind of want the full outfit and honestly with the skirt you could easily wear a black tank top with it like a crop top or maybe a band tee tuck it in you can make it look cute so yes this is the walk the line mini skirt so this is the skirt portion my cat's in here now levi playing with my shoes um i normally wear docks but since i'm obviously home i am wearing um my nightmare before christmas slippers your your cool friend here has to have comfort all the time but be spooky about it yeah, I'm filming this, by the way, at 8.49 at night. 
I had to work today and then I came home and made myself look nice for the video. If you guys haven't seen me all made up yet. So I figured I would. What is that? Oh, the little clips. Ew. Okay, sorry. I'm getting too involved in what I have in here. seeing spots not good dude kill start for one may i say this little tag even just the tag how amazing like i want to keep the tag and put it on my christmas tree for christmas time i'll probably keep it um so yeah i got the skirt it's in a size medium the tag already came off. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> I can keep it for my Christmas tree. <laughs> Sorry, getting distracted. Um, but yeah, so this is the skirt. It's in a, I got a size medium. Um, I'll put little comments when I do the little try-ons, the sizing of everything I got. Um, I went off of their sizing chart online and from everything that I've seen from other people that have bought and all the reviews, people are saying like, you know, true to your size. So I decided to buy my size. The cool part about this is this is definitely a way different material than I thought it would be. Um, oh, here's the whole skirt. It's a mini. We love her. Um, the material though, hella stretchy. We absolutely love that. And, um, we love that we can't see through that much. You'd have to be like really up close to like see anything. Um, but honestly, with this type of skirt, you definitely would have to watch what type of um, undergarments you wear <laughs> um, for sure. And then at the bottom, if you want to be, you know, that much more scandalous with the outfit, um, it has little clasps here. It's super taped up, so I can't get to it. Um, it's got little clasps at the bottom, so if you were to wear like tights, you can clasp the tights on, and I think that would look so cute, um, so spooky, of course. Um, I think I would definitely pair this with my docks, but two, um, I have a really nice pair of like kind of higher boots that I got just from Target, and I actually kind of wear them as more of my dress up boots. I think this would look so cute with it. So once again, that's the skirt. Definitely Beetlejuice vibes. Like, I love it. It's kind of funny, too. If you can't tell, I'm wearing purple eyeshadow. So definitely Beetlejuice vibes. <laughs> One of my favorite movies. Um, okay. That's the skirt. And then, this is the Stripe O Negative top. So this is the matching top that goes with the skirt that I just showed. I can figure out how to get it open. Um, I got the top in a medium too, just because I don't like tops that are super confining. It's annoying at that point. Oh, okay. So this is definitely crop top status for sure. Um, so I think this is adjustable. Yeah, it's got little adjustable hooks here. So you can adjust the top, which is good because these straps look a little big. Um, two, they got little clasps at the end. That's so cute. So they got these little metal chains at the end. Oh my God, and they say kill star on them. Hold on. I don't know if you can see that, but take my word for it. I promise I can read. It says Killstar. <laughs> really like it. Five Bowman when your cat and your dog are playing on the garbage or throwing on the floor, making it hard to hear the video. Hey, stop. Once again, we have the cute little tag that says Killstar on it. Um, and then the front of the top has a zipper, and uh, I really want to show it. Hold on. Let me see if I can get it off. 
the little zipper on the front. I think it's a spider if I remember correctly. Um, it is seriously the cutest thing. Einstein, stop. I like how I'm over here struggling and I literally have a knife in front of me the whole time. The knife that I opened the box with. <laughs> I get so nervous <laughs> that I'm gonna cut myself. Um. So side story, because don't we all just love rambling story times on YouTube? That's why we're here, right guys? Um, oh, shit. <laughs> Stop it. Ah, oh, it's not a spider, it's a skull and crossbones. Uh -huh. But um, anyway, story time. Speaking of being a klutz and cutting yourself. So when I was taking my prereqs to get into nursing school, I, um, we were doing, where was I at? Biology? I think it was bio. Um, we were doing a lab and we had to like measure stuff and we needed a glass pipette. And so I was like, oh, okay guys, like no big deal. I got it crew. You guys do you, I'll catch up. Um, so I go get our group, the glass pipette. I literally pick it up and as I pick it up and have it in my fingers, it breaks in my fingers and slices my finger open. And of course, like, you know how, like, at the beginning of the semester, you have to watch a safety video on all that crap about, like, oh, if an incident happens, you'll tell your professor and you won't keep it a secret. So I was like, okay, let me go be the good person and tell my professor. Wrong. Don't be that person unless you're seriously hurt. They made me go to the schools, like, the college's um, risk management person. I don't know who the hell he was. But I'm sitting back there and he's like, oh, that looks pretty serious. Do you need me to call 911? It's like, my finger is gushing blood at this point and I don't know how deep it is because I have a paper towel wrapped around it. But now that I'm a nurse and I'm like, I should have never wrapped a paper towel around it. That's stupid. If it gets stuck to the clot, it's gonna, whatever. That's the side point. Um, but yeah, um, I'm pretty much a klutz when it comes to everything. I didn't call 911 by the way because that would have been, stop it. Nope. That would have been retarded to call 911. Um, so I just sucked it up, got a band-aid, put it on it. Um, I still have a mark on my finger to this day. So you can see all my normal fingers with it. And then my ring finger, you can see that like light area of white, it scarred because of how deep it went. <laughs> but I am a nurse, live to tell the tale and I have not had a patient die on me yet. So, there's still time though in life. Okay, anyway. <laughs> so this is made out of the same cotton material. This is the matching top. And I might say she is so cute. Um, so like I said, that little zipper is a skull and crossbones. And she is so cute. Um, yeah, it's made out of that same stretchy material as the skirt. So actually, I'm going to seriously love wearing it. And that tag on the back, don't believe everything you think. We absolutely love Killstar for all this. Love it. Okay. The next thing in the box, I should only have two more things. Okay, I'm going to save that for last. I am so excited for her. So I'm gonna say that for last. This one, I'm excited for this too. I can't try it on for you right now, but like I said, it'll be in um, the snapshots of the video. Oh my God, I've already been talking for 19 minutes. What the hell? <laughs> Ignore me and my spazziness. I turn a literally one, two, three, four, five item haul. Oh, plus the doormats. So five, six, seven item haul into a freaking 25 minute video probably but I have to edit out a lot of this because I've been rambling okay so the next thing I got oh I didn't read the packaging <laughs> um the next thing I got is the Angelina choker um I really because 
speaking of um jade um jade the libra on youtube um has a chain choker that she wears sometimes and i was like damn i really want one like that i like how it looks because right now i literally have like the little cheap one that you can get from the dentist i actually got mine from claire's though it was supposed to be a friendship one but i didn't want the friendship portion so i ripped off the little friendship part just to have a plain black choker <laughs> um so I wanted a really nicer one, so I decided to invest. And this is the one that I got, and who she is fire. I am so excited to wear her. Oh my god. So this is her. She is thriving. She's gonna look great. I am so excited. Um, so I'll get up closer she is just a chain with a circle in the middle and then the like part that you put around like the back of your neck is leather straps and then two on the back of it it says kill oh it says kill star of course so that is so cute literally this is gonna look so cute i didn't want something super bulky because i feel like i get claustrophobic so that's that and then the last item in this box, I've literally been eyeing this purse forever. My inspiration, Jade the Libra. Let me put this down a little bit more, the, it like fell. Um, she ended up getting this bag and it had been out of stock for like months and I couldn't get it. And then when it came back into stock originally, I didn't have the money at the time. I was trying to pay off other stuff. Um, so I couldn't get it, but guess who got the bag okay she's big ah! okay um the bag is called never trust the living handbag once again very beetlejuice vibes hear all that it's my freaking we love I really love these cards like so freaking much they're so cool um this is kind of a cool little kill star baggy thing <laughs> guys she is more than I could have ever asked for oh my god um, it's faux leather, by the way, but oh my god, I am literally so excited. So, I have currently one of their other handbags right now. Um, it's a small one, and it's like a little shoulder bag um, with a long chain, and the actual pocket size bag is not that big. It's got a pentagram on it. I love the bag so much, but the straps up top are finally coming like apart sort of. So I'm gonna try to use it more as just like a going out bag. And I wanted something a little bit bigger as my everyday bag. This is perfect. Literally dying. Okay, let me show you guys. Oh my God. Isn't she amazing? Okay, let me get up close. It's got a bat on it that says Killstar Occult Luxury. Yeah, Occult Luxury. And you can't tell, but the little C's, their detail is seriously so amazing. Um, the little C's on the Occult. It won't zoom in. Um, they're little moons. They're little half moons. I think that is so cool. Um... The back has a little zipper pocket. I don't really know how deep. Probably not that deep. Oh, it's actually pretty deep. Like, it fits my whole hand almost. It's got the two leather straps we love. Um, it's got two side pockets. That is so nice. And then... the inside oh. <laughs> I didn't even know it came with this oh my god 
It comes with a big strap so you don't have to do the little straps. Oh my God, yes. Okay. The inside is very spacious. Holy, holy crap. It's got a little fuzzy inside. I don't know if you guys can tell how deep that is. I'll put my hand in. Like, my hand's completely flat at the bottom and it covers up to like my elbow. That's a lot of room, holy crap. I'm so excited. Um, and it's got two smaller pockets here on the side and then it's got a zip pocket in the back. So pretty basic for pockets, but it's got a lot of storage. I am so excited. I've literally been itching to open this box just so I could get my bag. <laughs> so excited. And then you can, oh, did I just break my nail? No, okay, we're good. These, by the way, natural nails. <laughs> I just need to file them and paint them. My nails grow pretty fast. I got blessed with my grandmother's nails. This is her in all of her glory. So let me put this in here so I don't lose it. Um, and then I'm gonna take you guys out there to see the mats. we got um why isn't it zooming excuse me focus there we go it says welcome to hell and then of course kill star and it's got let me oh, perfect um it's got the little um his name is totally escaping me the little devil baphomet little guy on it he is so cute literally love the graphic details and i love that the welcome to hell is like welcome to is in cursive and the hell looks like really cool graphically um and then it's got the cute little devil cow looking guys ah, love it so obviously that's at the front door where it says welcome to hell and then the other mat is here at the back door I don't have the best lighting but it is literally a little spooky spider web and it's in the shape of an actual web too which I thought was really cool and unique and it's got the little spider here he's kind of harder to see because he's in dark gray kind of and then on the side it says kill star anyway I thought those were pretty good purchases I loved them honestly like two of those quality of the mats are so good like very like heavy duty material and very durable, which we love that. But yes, that is the end of the box and end of the non-box. Um, so yeah, Hillstar, this is my first like big, bigger haul that I've spent quite a bit of money for Killstar. Oof, hold on. Eh. But this is the first big haul that I've spent quite a bit of money for Killstar of my own. Um, because I've never been, like, sponsored by them or anything like that, of course. Um, and I must say I am very thoroughly impressed with all of the stuff I got. Um, they all feel like they're very good quality stuff. No. But yeah, they all feel like they're really good quality material. I feel like I'm a very strong and firm believer of you pay for what you get. So Killstar, you knocked it out of the park with your products. Absolutely love it. Like I said, um, I didn't get sponsored. This is just something that like, I want to support the company. I love the company a lot. <laughs> um, and of course, in the future, if they ever wanted to sponsor, I would absolutely say yes. But um, two, I did it. They always, 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 they always have sales going on. So literally they're having an Easter sale. I think everything's 25% off right now. I literally went on there to go buy more stuff and I was like, Jamie, you need to calm down. <laughs> so, but um, I've already been talking long enough in this video. <laughs> um, so... 
like this video if you liked the content or if you would like to see more um comment down below if you've ever shopped at killstar if i've convinced you to shop at killstar i don't know if i really have convinced anybody to shop at killstar but personally one of my favorites um but yeah like the video um subscribe to keep up with more spooky and nurse content I'm trying to do a good mixture of both. My first two videos, well, my first video is more explaining about who I was as a person. My second video was my day in the life of my job. Um, so you get to see kind of what I do day to day, Monday through Friday. I work a normal job, but subscribe to my channel. You're gonna see more spooky content, more day in the life videos of a nurse. Um, I do plan on doing some future videos I have in mind. Oh, sorry. It keeps like sliding now. I think it's my case. Um, but as far as nursing goes, I do plan on shooting like a nursing favorites video. Um, not that I'm inpatient anymore, but I still do use quite a bit of the stuff that I did use inpatient as far as like my pens that I use. I sadly don't really use my stethoscope anymore, but it, I will always stand by my stethoscope and the brand that I used. Loved it. Um, so yeah, like I said, I do plan on filming a nursing favorites or nursing essentials video. Um, and then kind of like a vlog day in the life slash more spookier alternative content. I am next weekend going to Earth Day birthday and I'm literally so excited. This will be my first time ever going to Earth Day birthday and my favorite band is going to be there motionless and white they've already dodged me once before um we were supposed to go see them me and my husband at um, why am i it's not rockville i don't know what it was they were coming to florida literally we were packing our stuff to go because the concert was going to start an hour it was like an outdoor festival i and like i said i live in the central florida area so it was here it was local. It's literally only like a 25 minute drive from where I live now. Um, but they dodged us once before. Um, so try again, Chris motionless. I'm coming for you. You better watch out. Um, but yeah, so I plan on um, vlogging the day and just showing you me getting ready for the concert. If my husband wants to be in the video, yeah, I'm going to try to get some video of the venue. It's not really a venue. Earth Day Birthday is outside. I'm going to try to get um, stuff from the festival. I'm definitely going to be buying merch. Um, I love supporting local bands. Every time now I've decided I go to a concert, I'm going to be getting a t-shirt for the bands that I like. I want to support the bands and keep music alive. So that is what I will be doing. So I'm going to film for you guys when I go there. So that'll be another video coming up. Um, that one's next week. But the process of editing and all that is I'm still learning the system that I downloaded on my computer. So it's taking time. Um, Einstein would like to say goodbye to you all. <laughs> He's just like freaking out right now. Hey, Einstein. <laughs> um, but yeah, like the video if you want to see more spooky content or more nursing related content. Comment down below. Love to talk to you guys. Let me know if you guys love Killstar, if you shop there as well, what your favorite products are, if you've bought in any of these products, um, what else you want to see video content. Like, just talk. I would love to talk down below. Um, and then subscribe to my channel if you guys want to see more. Um, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!